Welcome to part two of our review of the events of 2013. The big part two of the travel report. Yes. And we will start with the Games in the UK. UK. Yes. Yeah. Actually, Games that I've been to six times now, I think, five or six times. And, uh, well, total of 23 points have to be explained. Not yes. so high. Uh, well, first of all, community, because that's the nice part about it. Eight points. Um, Unfortunately, there weren't very many people there uh, compared to the last couple yeah. of years, but community was really, really good. We got the pre-game stay dinner and so on. I, I really liked it. Mm -hmm. So uh, maybe there's just minus one because of the amount of people. Yeah. Um, but um, I mean, again, I just talked to so many guys there. It was sure. uh, awesome. Uh, miniatures, um, seven. And that's actually a guess because we really <laughs> couldn't see them. <laughs> Um, uh, the miniatures were displayed somewhere in the catacombs. Uh, you had to uh, uh, go down four uh, flights of stairs. Um, the, the lighting was horrible. Um, yeah, I don't even know what to say. Um, I mean, we all know it's like this, but I mean, how much does it cost um, to put some LEDs light up? <laughs> so, um, no, but I'd say there was uh, some really nice miniatures as always at any game stay. Um, but uh, there was also uh, a lot of not so high standard product yeah. managers. And I have to say, compared to the uh, last uh, years, uh, I would say at least half of the amount of managers there. So a real steep decline, which was which was kind of sad. So seven uh, might seem a little high. Seven, seven might actually seem a little high. Um, but I think David's uh, diorama for the Slayer Sword yeah. kind of <laughs> put it up to seven again. He, he restored our faith in miniature <laughs> painting. So. Uh, the venue, six points. Um, it was not at the uh, NEC anymore. Um, it was at uh, the NIA. Um, and if you read the blog, um, it was all sales. Uh, there was not a single gaming yeah. table, not one. And um, Weird decision for a game stay. Yeah, it's a company that sells games for gamers and there's no gaming table. Yeah. Um, I, they don't do this for the painters. At least that's what we thought. So if that's the case, go on. Just new light and you're, you're good. <laughs> uh, show, yeah, four points. There was no show. Yeah. Uh, I have to say that uh, as a fanboy, I like to talk to the Forge World guys. I like to talk to the... To the my, my favorite team is the this limited edition uh, people there. Uh, all really nice guys. But as far as show is concerned, you can spend an hour, maybe two, yeah. and then you're bored. There's That's nothing it. to do. Yeah. And um, so, yeah, I don't want to go shopping there. I can do this everywhere else. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah um, I don't know if I'm going to go back next year. Probably will. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. But, yeah. So, um, yeah, we have um, minus one customer appreciation again because it's really expensive to go there. Um, and minus one for the light, because there's no reason to have this kind of bad lighting for a miniature uh, show. Especially if miniatures is really the only thing you can do. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, another highlight. We had two events on one weekend. Yeah, so we split up. Uh, I, I, last year I would promise I would be back to the, for the Hussar. Yeah. And you went to Modena for Games Day Italy. The, uh, also my first Games Day Italy ever. Oh really? So, yeah, I yeah, yeah. See, I didn't know that. Cool. Well, let's uh, start with the Hussar uh, first. 36 points for an event run by private people uh, without uh, millions in the, in, yeah. the, in the pocket. Really, really good. Um, community, 10 points. Uh, the Polish painters, Michal, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is an insider, but no, the, the, the Polish painters are so nice, uh, so friendly. Yeah. The, the, um, the show was not free. I think it cost a euro 20 or something. <laughs> so it was basically free. Yeah. Um, I mean, you just felt right at home. So, uh, miniatures, um, nine points. 170 very entries, high. I think it was, mm -hmm. uh, something in that area. And uh, the standard is very high. Um, of course, yeah. we had a lot of, uh, um, of the Polish painters are just excellent painters. Yeah. Uh, but this year, uh, compared to last year, uh, where only Nakata and myself were foreigners there, we had a lot of Russians there, we had a, 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 a people from all... We had Stefan, yeah. Yeah, Sweden, who <laughs> got the best of show. Um, and uh, I hope you received your sword yet, it's uh, in the mail. <laughs> but uh, no, it's, I would say managers was really nice. And uh, plus one point there for the best light. I think uh, it was 150 euros, they invested in LED lights and, uh, uh, and uh, kind of electricity stuff. Yeah. And the light was perfect. I mean... And it's so important on the yeah, show. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's just uh, awesome. Um, the venue, 8 point, um, it's a small, uh, what do you call those, like community center mm -hmm. uh, there. Uh, but it's kind of nice because you got the show uh, in a separate room. You have uh, kind of an auditorium with a stage. Uh, you had uh, demonstrations all day long. So I would say it's definitely fitting. 
uh, but I fear that they will be very successful in the future. So maybe yeah. next year they will still be there. If they can hold all the people uh, the year after, it's going to be the question. We have to see that. Yeah, and then the show has already indicated nine points. Um, definitely really nice. Yeah. Um, you were busy all day from speed painting to uh, uh, Carol Woodick workshops. <laughs> uh, or uh, what's his name? Uh, Juan Cabos? Uh, uh, hmm? Is it Cabos? I think so. I don't know. <laughs> the Andre Andrea guy. I'm yeah, sorry, yeah. I'm going to put it in the subtitles if I mess this up. Um, he did a, a presentation on how to paint uh, pin-up uh, uh, oh, miniatures nice. and stuff. Yeah. So really, really high uh, quality entertainment. And then the after show party is epic. Epic, epic, epic. Um, so yeah, um, just an awesome show. 36 point. I'll be back next year, definitely. And so should you. Yeah, now we come to another <laughs> highlight of uh, yeah. this year, which is uh, the last game state Italy. Yeah, I have to say now. The, the last as far as we know today. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was my first game stay in Italy and actually I, I'm quite sad about uh, how the whole event was because um, the Italians are great people, yeah. I love to meet the people there, they're so friendly and it's also, they, they make you feel at home. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the, the game stay itself uh, was really terrible. I mean, it was so empty, it felt like only tumbleweed is missing to <laughs> fulfill the, the complete scene. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, so uh, community we got still seven points yeah. just because of the people there and it's only seven because there was so few I mean we, if you saw the, the report on the blog um, yeah it's without words I mean there's almost no one there uh, was it 400 and how many people yeah 400 including staff <laughs> <laughs> so so between four and five hundred yeah. uh, but it was really empty the, yeah. the venue itself was not that bad but for that uh, few people it just seemed so empty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then uh, miniatures, only six points. Yeah. I think that one of the things that uh, also is kind of weird, or was the weird there, was the judging. Um, if uh, not so much for the Slayer sword, I think that yeah. was fine. Um, maybe not with that miniature, but he had like three or four miniatures that it was really, really nice. Yeah, and I mean, his standard is really amazing. Yeah. Yeah. The, the stuff's just so flawless. Yeah. It's, it's flawless. They're absolutely flawless. And uh, it was maybe not a, a spectacular diorama, it was a skeleton. Uh, what, what did you call it? The ugly skeleton or something? <laughs> the ugly little skeleton. Ugly <laughs> little skeleton, yeah. No, awesome, awesome piece, yeah. definitely. So well deserved. But if you then uh, hear that uh, 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 Rusto, who won the best of show in Mon San Savino, yeah. which we'll talk about in a second, uh, uh, got nothing with the explanation, it's a not good painting. <laughs> and his piece was also amazing. Yeah. But I mean, uh, just the decision, decisions are always uh, yeah. questionable. Yeah. Uh, but that f felt really weird in some of the categories. Yeah. So, so uh, all together it's uh, 22 points, yeah. which is very, very low. Yeah, yeah the show was only 3 points. Yeah, so low. Uh, and again, for, unfortunately for a game search, I can, just, I can say across the board because US got plus point, 1 plus points there, yeah. but minus 1 for customer appreciation. Um, it's just a sales event and I mean no reason to go there. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Monte San Savino. The Monte San Savino show. Monte San Savino show. The uh, last show this year for us? Yes. Um, unfortunately, because unfortunately, because somebody made us sick. <laughs> Where's your mask? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So um, the Monte San Savino show is really a must go. Yeah. It's 10 points regarding community for sure. Yes. Um, because because there's a limit of ten points. Yeah, I mean we would give them fourteen points. Yeah, we, we thought so, but uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's it's capped. Rules are rules. Yeah. Um, read the report. Look at the pictures. Um, it's without words. It, yeah. it is without words. It's a three-day event, which is nice. Um, and you were doing something all the time. You were never bored. Yeah. yeah. So so always people to talk to. Yeah. Uh, a lot of food. <laughs> a lot of good food. A lot of drinks. Wine. Yeah, yeah, it was great. Miniatures. What should we say? Ten points. Ten points. Yeah. Um, Insane. How many entries did they have? Fifteen hundred. Yeah, I think they have. Yeah, something like that. at least fifteen hundred miniatures. Uh, I only managed over three days to uh, take about a thousand pictures of miniatures there, and the standard is insane. Yeah. I, for me, I've never been to a World Expo, but I can't imagine a World Expo to be better than this. Yeah, I've been to two World Expos, and I must say, um, maybe the one in um, in 
Girona holds up with it, but on the other hand, it's just it's every year it's thousand five hundred figures. Yeah. It's just crazy. Yeah, absolutely good. The venue. 10 points. Ten points. <laughs> I mean, okay. uh, it's not easy to get to, but yeah. once you're there, it's just, uh, it's, it's, it's almost like a fairy tale city come true. Yeah. It's just so it's nice. Just it's Italy. Yeah, and it's so Tuscany. Yeah. And it's so beautiful. Yeah. Um, it's really amazing. It's like, like a, a catalog, a travel catalog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. for three days full time. Yeah, yeah. so it was, it was awesome. And then, of course, the show. Yeah. 10 points. 10 points. I mean, there was. Uh, there was no gaming or stuff going on, but there was uh, presentations. There was um, um, big presentations. Uh, what was his name? From uh, John Rosengrant. Uh, John Rosengrant, um, like a special effects uh, artist. You probably know him. And um, um, you were busy the whole time. And then there was always a lunch break, which was nice. Yeah. So you had the morning. You did some stuff. Uh, you had the lunch break. Had some good food. It was an extended lunch break. I would have to say. Usually. Also, it's it was nice because it was like a real cut. Yeah. People took a break, sat down, talked with other people yeah. without uh, running over the show. And, yeah. Oh, I have to look at this, or I have to look at that. It was just okay. Sit down, relax, yeah. talk yeah. to people. So uh, yeah, um, forty points. Uh, Forty-two is the maximum with bonus points, but we have to deduct one point. Yeah. For for lighting. Sorry, Francesco. Yes, uh, we have to work on that for next year. Um, the light was not the best. It wasn't the worst, definitely not, uh, but it wasn't, it wasn't the best. I think some sort of uh, LED lighting would really be beneficial because there are so many beautiful pieces and you really want to appreciate them in all their glory. Especially because a lot of people had really a lot of figures in their, in their displays, so it was really hard to see anything without a proper light. Yeah. But um, guys, if there's any show you want to go to, like one show next year, yeah. and you can't go to any other show, this is definitely our recommendation, isn't it? Definitely. Yeah. 39 points out of 42 possible points, and it was the highlight of a year. So, Yeah, then unfortunately FEMA J, which also looked like a very nice event, and yeah. we'll be there next year, we couldn't go to then. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah very, very sorry for that. Um, sorry, Ed. Yeah. Yeah, we had a lot of uh, cool stuff prepared actually for the show, yeah. and uh, we just couldn't go because we were both sick. Right. Okay, so uh, yeah, there's going to be a lot of events next year. Um, stay tuned to masterminis.net. Uh, we will put up a calendar uh, definitely for, uh, for the next year as well, mm -hmm. and uh, we'll always do the reports. So if you can't go, um, you might miss the community and the fun, but you're not going to miss anything of the, of the rest. <laughs> That's true. If you have any events uh, you would like to see us, yes. uh, just let us know uh, and we'll talk about it. That's actually a good point because a lot of events we only know uh, or hear about after the fact. Oh, did you hear about so and so last week? Uh, what event? <laughs> so, so that's definitely something. If, if you have an event uh, for next year, uh, contact us, uh, Facebook, uh, blog or whatever, or email. And um, uh, we we'll definitely put up some uh, advertising for you guys. Uh, it's going to be free. Uh, there's no cost involved. Maybe we're going to even sponsor some prizes. So, yeah, sounds yeah. like a good plan. All right. See thank you. you. See you next year around the world. <laughs> okay. Cool. <laughs> All right. Welcome to part two. Fact or not, all right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right. All right. So. <laughs> so. Okay. Welcome to part two. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. Welcome to. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> it's too <dirty. coughs> Oh man. Ah, ich warte.